my wife like that, bro. You got brush with me? about your camera. Hey, please. please. I'll fucking kill hey, you right hey, now, hey, dude. Back off. All right, it's Casey Camera Boy here. Doing the First Amendment order on this place. See if these people respect our First Amendment. If they don't, they probably don't respect the environment as well. So we'll see. She's worried if she's gonna be on TV or I don't anything. want like my I don't yeah, they, she doesn't want to be on film but she approached us right now so I don't get it. I'm confused. I wish we worked for TV too. Huh? I go I wish we I wish we had our own TV channel. I know but like what do you guys do taking We're working on a project. Oh, we're, okay. We're recording. Yeah. Alright, well I saw the camera go our way, so I just want to make sure I was It. There she goes. She's gonna probably gonna go right and rattle us out. That's it. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, they're pissed, bro. Even the chunky butt there is pissed too. We're not on a private property. Uh, this is all private property. This is not private property. What's up with your Jigaboo over there? Huh? Trying to. So you're here to entertain her while she gets a picture of my vehicle? Yeah, you're the entertainer. You look like a clown. Okay, but you're the entertainer. That's why you came, to entertain us. Distract us. Yeah. You heard this, man? Hey, you never seen a 2020 vehicle that you gotta take pictures of it? You guys are from you, you, ne you, ne you never seen a 2020 vehicle? If you haven't, I'll feel you. Who's that, though? She's it. She's hyper hyperventilating right now. We're calling the sheriff right now, so if you guys want to uh, get the hell out of here. Man, you can call Trump if you want to. You think I give a crap? Sorry? You, you can call Trump if you want to. You think I give a crap? Pardon? Stay, stay within a safe distance, man. No, you get off the property. What property? This is Force. not your property. This is your Stay within Force. a distance. You're not wearing a mask. Okay, sheriff's coming. Okay. Man, you can call whoever the hell you want to. Okay. You need to get a real job and stop being a passenger. You're not making money for him. Are you kidding? I'm yeah. Money with Shut him. up. You're just a passenger. No, no. Shut Who are you guys? None of your business. I could have been cool to you. You approach me, I'm gonna put you on the floor. Talking to my wife like that, bro. Hey, you approach me, hey, please. About your camera. Hey, please. I'll fucking kill you hey, right hey, now, hey, dude. Back hey, off. Please. Back off. Back off. Okay. I'm a pepper spray, dude. Back you off. You gonna care, dude? You gonna care, dude? Trust me. Oh my god. You gonna care, dude? You need to watch the way you. You need to tell her to watch her mouth, not to act like a man. What your cause is, you need to watch the way. Talk. Then tell her not to be acting like a man. She doesn't want to deal with a man. Tell her not to act like a man. Dude, you're. Man, learn how to fucking talk to women. Period. Well, tell her, tell her to talk to learn how to talk knock to a man. Knock off, bro. N tell her to what knock the it fuck off. What are you even doing here? We it's apologize. gonna cost we you your job. Yeah. It's gonna cost you your job, dude. Trust me. I have the deal to even check under Go your mattresses. Yourself, bro. Do it yourself. Yes, Vicky. I'm sorry. What did he say? Um, I said, "What are you guys doing? What are you filming?" And he uh, said, uh, "We're making." Sense. 
what did he say to you? Oh, he said, he said tell me how did he disrespect you? What is he gonna do? How does she disrespect me? Ask her. Ask her first. Ask her first. Ask her first. She yeah. told me to get a job. To yeah. She told me to get a job. This is a job. She came off rude. Like so she came off rude to me, but I can't do it to her? Nah, dude. That doesn't work like that. That doesn't work like that, dude. I don't have to explain myself to you. I don't have to explain myself to you. And you guys said too bad. I was nice to you at first, but then you start being rude to me. I'm going to defend myself. No, I wasn't. I, I wasn't. I wasn't. I wasn't rude to you. Yeah. yeah, they're driving a... 2020, just in case. The same way you're not respecting my First Amendment, that's how you respect environmental laws out there, huh? That's how you respect the environmental laws, huh? You're probably chopping up streets that you're not supposed to, huh? Yeah, yeah, laugh, laugh. Trust me, I'm gonna pull all your permits if I want to. I can place a, a subpoena on you. You can laugh, you can laugh. Trust me, I put you out there in the map. You can laugh all you want to, trust me. Funny how you women can treat men however you want to, but when we treat you guys like the same way you guys treat us, then you guys start tripping, huh? You start defending her too, start filming. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've got... Yeah, I've got my pickup. Can you go back can you go back in a Go back to work. You're dismissed. That is for us. That's probably the walk of shame there. Huh? Who do you guys work for? Who do you work for? Who do you work for? Who do you work for? So now we got the sheriff here, according to them. My man, you can tell it's a tyrant, but he's laughing at them already, bro. You can tell he's gonna laugh at them. Be back right now. <laughs> I can't do nothing. <laughs> Told you. That cops can't do anything. What the heck are you gonna do? <laughs> That's a laugh of shame drive and shame. a drive of shame. Fucking wanna be cop over there. Look at him. Look at that peasant there. <laughs> look, 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 look. A boss. I was just trying to be your hero, boss. He did serve a dollar raise for making that move. One dollar raise to him for making that move. As a matter of fact, give that guy a promotion. I feel like Oprah right now, bro. Give him a promo. She's in Ohara. <laughs> Second, is. second walk of shame there. Walk of shame. There it is, guys. Walk of shame. Walk of shame there, just in case. That's it. Just no directives, man. We don't need no directives. <laughs> How you guys doing? Pretty no good. Boundaries. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to contact you guys on big calls. It was a little verbal argument. Okay. That's fine. I mean, you guys are just filming. You guys aren't on the property. You guys ain't violating any rights. Yes, sir. So, um, I understand. But, I mean, they called, so we gotta come out here. Thank you. Um, the only question is, maybe to see what you guys are doing? Oh, I'm working on a First Amendment project. Okay. That's all. We told them, we told the passenger, the truck driver as well, 
and then they start getting pissed and irate and which I try to explain them what we were doing at first. Yeah. They just came out of They seem room. they seem not to comprehend and think they start telling them, oh you better get the hell out of here before like the sheriff come and then you're in private property. That's when I was like, whoa, wait a minute, this is probably property, we're doing this, this and that. If you don't like it, well now it's up to you. And then they start getting mad. That driver tried to approach me and beat me up. So try to fight me yeah. because his wife was getting irate at me. Did we ever get physical? No, no, no. Luckily, he, he didn't get physical. Just the girls yeah, just verbal. Okay. Yeah, I was trying to de-escalate. They were too, actually, they were too. They were trying to de-escalate the situation, so okay. nothing happened after that. The, the only thing, their employees are going to get off at two. Okay. So they're just worried that there's no conversation. No, no, no. no. So, I mean, I'm, I'm not here to kick you guys out. I'm just, well, okay. I'll just be driving around because I don't want... Yeah. Want any of their employees to get offended? Yeah, if anybody's yeah. violent, man, it's gonna be them. Yeah. Um, we're just gonna have we'll to just, ourselves. I'm just gonna wait for you to leave. Once you leave, after like two, three minutes, I'll leave. Uh, that I'll way they don't think that you kick me out. Okay. That's the only. This, this is my sergeant coming up. I already told her everything that's going on. Okay. Um, okay. Like I said, you guys aren't breaking any laws. Thank you, sir. You guys are just creating a documentary. Yeah. I understand that. First Amendment Project. Yeah, I, I watch it all the time. Oh, I, you do? Oh, I see you guys. Well, Have you seen me? I I'll come in and brought me the Red Bull. Like you're on the other side of the camera, so I don't. I don't see oh, okay, okay. Shout out to Ramirez, man. <laughs> right, man. I would have taken a Red Bull. But, um, Next time. Yeah, as long as as long as there's no physical altercation. No, no. Fine with no. I was backing up the whole time. He kept approaching me until the lady came and she stopped him. So I was alright, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, it's my sergeant. Holy moly. Get it good about yourself. I'll take a pat down. Oh, no, no, thank you. Just, okay. I mean, he, can you explain that we just, we're getting calls? Yeah. Uh, the business? Okay. Yeah. Are you guys are right? all right? You guys are Yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. Um, I, I'm assuming now they're good as well, so. I'm sorry? I'm assuming now they're good because he explained them. Okay. So. That's perfect. Yeah. I just want to make sure we check with you guys too because we already checked with the oh, Okay. Yeah. All right? Yeah, thank you. All right. Can we get your name and badge number? Of course. Uh, I am Sergeant Vieira and my badge number is 1145. Vieira. Yeah. Where is that last name from? If you don't mind me asking. You know what? It might be, I don't know. I, I'm Mexican, but... Because I heard Vieira oh. before. Yeah. But Vieira. Vieira. Yeah, with an I. I right. heard it before. Yeah. kind of swap, you know, the spelling of it. Yeah. So, I think it's Hispanic. But then again, it might be, you know, with Portuguese, he said, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Okay. I have it. All right, so, well. Thank all you. right, Perfect. guys. Well, um, you know, just stay safe. Thank okay? you. Okay, watch for traffic. Sometimes, you know, vehicles tend to drive uh, pretty quickly here. See, there's one behind you right there. I didn't even hear them. It's slow, but yeah. make sure you guys uh, keep, uh, are aware. And also, you know, I mean, you guys are doing your, you know, whatever, um, right and everything, but just, uh, I'm sorry? Can I stop you real quick? We don't we don't need directives. Like, we already know. Oh, I'm not giving you directives. I'm just saying, you know, just uh, there's gonna be other people, you know, stopping at me by and know that, you know, like, we came out here just for their call. But you guys are fine. They've been advised. Anything else we can help you with? You're very very professional. Thank you. All right. Well, thank you. Have That's a great it. day. You as well. Have a good day. Mm -hmm. good All day, right. Guys. Thank you, man. Have a good one. Well, there's nothing they can do, bro. They have to act professional. They're doing what they're supposed to be doing. So I give them. Started on that kind of huh? I mean, because they're they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. Thank you for that. No problem. How was it? Thank you for uh, giving me the time to take a picture. Oh. <laughs> hey, you have a recording too. <laughs> oh, this guy. Have a good one. All right, this is it. Casey Cameron, boy. Uh, they left now, and now. There it is. That's a that's a bit that's a that's a eighty thousand drive of shame right there, dude. Eighty thousand pounds drive of shame. Actually, those are those are even more. And that's like the what the four thousand pounds of shame there, drive of shame. Are you sick? Get your camera, boy. He's gonna do it.